Hey, it's Emery. I know that the lighting is kind of crappy in here because I'm in an office and I'm wearing all black and everything around me is white. But anyways, um, so yesterday, January 12th, 2018, was my one month on tea, so I wanted to kind of talk about my updates since going on tea. So um, I went to Planned Parenthood uh, about a month and a week ago. Um, because I wanted to talk about low-dose testosterone. And I was having a toss-up between if I should go on tea or not because I wanted 90% of the effects of tea and then 10% I definitely didn't want and so I wanted to see um, how I felt just talking to them because I'd been deliberating over it for almost, I think, six months um, by myself just worrying one way or another if I should do it or if I shouldn't do it and then I thought if I go to Plant Parenthood and just talk to them, it can't hurt anything. Um, so I ended up doing that and I went and, uh, I went for a, like a consultation appointment and talked to a guy about everything that he knew about testosterone and how you can go on lower doses and things like that. And, um, the fact that I would want to go slower and start on a lower dose and maybe stop at a certain point or start on a very low dose and just continue for longer because it's going so much more slowly. Um, and basically he answered all my questions and by the end of the conversation I felt comfortable. And so I got my hormones through informed consent and I decided that um, I'll take whatever effects that T gives me and if I want to stop at some point I can always stop. Um, and so I started on a half dose, a 0.25 cc and um, the normal dose is 0.5, I think it's 100 milligrams per whatever it is well, I don't know what the measurement is but anyways I'm on 0.25 cc um, weekly and so I went on that a week or a couple days after my consultation appointment they had me come back in um, I met with a clinician she talked to me about the more medical side of it rather than like the effects and stuff more about like what the hormones actually do um, and she confirmed that that's what I would need and she gave me my prescription I went out and got my prescription and the closest pharmacy to the Planned Parenthood that I went to frequents people getting testosterone so they knew what I was coming in for when I handed the prescription they knew uh, to be ambiguous about pronouns and um, to not say anything kind of out loud about the testosterone so the people around me wouldn't be like weirded out so it was just nice because they were understanding of the process and made me feel comfortable and um, they were really helpful with getting me a discount on my testosterone prescription with a good RX card which if you haven't gotten testosterone yet you should google or um, look up GoodRx on the App Store because it can get you like 50% off or something like that of your um, testosterone prescription if your insurance doesn't cover it. With, um, it ended up being like, I think $40 for my vial and my vial should last me like six months or more. So that's nice. So yeah, I got it that day. I went back and I administered my own shot for the first time, which was crazy. I've never heard of someone doing their very first shot on their own. It's usually like a nurse showing them how to do it, but she walked me through it verbally and I did it myself. Um, I hesitated for probably 35, 40 minutes, um, <laughs> sitting there just scared to actually do the needle by myself, but uh, she was patient with me and really nice. Anyway, so on to my uh, effects that I've noticed. So far, I guess I'll go head to toe. So far, nothing's really happened to my hair, I don't think. My hairline seems to be the same. I've always been a little bit thinner right here, so I don't I don't know if that's changed or not, but yeah. <clears throat> so that's the same. I think my eyebrows are getting thicker slightly. Um, I have acne now all along my jawline mostly. I've gotten like a few tiny ones up here, but it's like 90% right here. Um, and I had zero facial hair pre-tea and so I have kind of beach fuzz now like 
it was completely clear and I had like one chin hair that was actually brown, but nothing else. Um, and so now I think the peach fuzz is getting thicker pretty much everywhere in this area, but you can't really see the difference. Let's see. Oh, I think my like eyebrow bone is poking out more. You can kind of see it in the comparison photos that I took. I might insert that here. Um, Pre-T it was pretty flat. And now it seems like there's like a little bit of a ridge. So I don't know if that's possible, but uh, that. I think my jaw is getting thicker, like wider, and it's kind of come up now. It used to be like rounder and straighter, and now it's kind of like doing this, there's like a defined jaw, and then it comes up a little bit. I don't know if you can tell. Um, I don't think my neck has gotten any thicker. I was hoping it would. It might have. It feels stronger than it used to. My muscle definition is a lot better. I have comparison photos for that too. Uh, so that's gotten stronger. I feel stronger overall when I do like push-ups and stuff like that. I feel like I can actually do them now, which I couldn't really before. I could, but I would do like 15 and feel like I'm gonna die, like I couldn't push up anymore. Um, and now I'm doing a lot more than that. I do it in sets now though, smaller sets and more reps than I was uh, pre -t. Let's see. I honestly feel like I'm getting some fat redistribution, which people say that doesn't happen until like six months or more, but I used to have like really big like hips slash love handle area. It was just wider and kind of fattier there and I'm not like large person or anything but that's where my body would hold fat and now it seems like it's going away a little bit and maybe coming to my stomach but I don't know Happy trail is growing. I used to have hair like maybe an inch above and an inch below my belly button and around it. And now it's kind of like two inches above and below, which is cool. Or more like two and a half inches above and one and a half inch below. Um, and that's cool. I like that. I pretty had a lot of leg hair, so. I can't tell if I've gotten more leg hair or not. My girlfriend says it might have gotten thicker than it was before, but I haven't really noticed anything. It's just, it's just there. Um, there's a lot. I always had hair on my thighs and um, my lower legs, so that hasn't been a big difference for me, but um, I can't think of anything else other than overall body, like muscle definition. So that's been cool. Um, but now I guess I'll do my voice comparison. Um, this is my voice pretty. My name is Emery. It is December 12th, 2017, and I got my very first low dose testosterone shot today. My name is Emery. It's January 12th, 2018, and I'm one month on tea today. So, um, so far, I obviously want to continue my tea journey because before I had. I was concerned that I might want to like go on and then immediately stop because things are going too quickly or something, um, but I'm good so far so I'm going to stay on this path and um, yeah, I'm going to keep going with it and keep doing updates and I update a lot of my Instagram which is at mthelostboy um, at Instagram and yeah, if you want to follow my journey day to day, I put a lot of stuff on there. Um, stories and pictures and things. I post at least once a day, I think. And um, so you can follow me there. Otherwise, check back in here and I'll probably do monthly testosterone updates or maybe every two months or something. It depends on how quickly things go. So yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to keep paying attention to my transition. Like if you notice a change. 
in my voice or anything about me if you see a difference from our older videos and um, comment if you have any questions about me or low dose testosterone or non-binary transitioning or something like that that you feel like I can answer I'm more than willing to answer that down in the comments or make a response video if you want to see more about that um, either way thanks for watching and bye